the secret of Silo's tunnel system still persists, despite the suspenseful finale of Silo Season 1 revealing some of the dark realities that the founders had been trying to hide. The film Silo narrates the tale of Juliet Nichols, who set out to unravel the secrets of the secret society that had taken refuge inside the Silo to avoid the dangers of the outside world. The first episode of the series featured Allison, a net professional who was searching a restricted hard drive for information on the Silo. One of these secrets was a thorough schematic of the complex, along with minute information on the tunnels beneath it. It was first thought that the silo occupants would be able to go through these tunnels to reach the outside world because what they have been told does not appear to be totally accurate. But as the season's conclusion approached, the significance of these tunnels grew. They now have a lot of relevance because there are suggestions that they will be further explored in Silo Season 2. There may be more silos, Jules notices craters. The dramatic conclusion of Silo Episode 10 shows viewers Juliet being sent out to clean after she was apprehended by Bernard for attempting to reveal the details hidden on a prohibited hard drive. She noticed a film depicting the outer world as thriving and alive outside of the silo on the hard drive. But as soon as she walked outdoors, she understood that the mesmerizing scene had only been a manufactured simulation. The true reality was a barren wasteland covered with numerous craters, just like the one she had just left. This implies that there are silos in addition to their own. With this additional information, it is clear that the tunnel system beneath their silo may act as a network connecting these different silos. With this knowledge, Juliet might be able to move through the tunnels. She could use the tunnel network to get to Silo 18 to meet up with her family. Why the tunnel systems around the silo are encircled by water. When Juliet viewed the message from George, he discussed the significance of the tunnels and highlighted a mystifying door that Juliet had to figure out how to open. I guess you're wondering what I did about the water, George said. It turns out there was nothing to worry about after all. By making this remark, the water appears to be acting as a disincentive to prevent silo occupants from exploring farther in search of the metal door George mentioned. There are several options for the type of water. Those who have lived their entire lives within the silo may feel more dread of the unknown because of the illusion of how deep the water may appear due to the surrounding darkness. It could simply be a few inches deep, coming to a person's chest. Alternately, George may have trained himself to swim, allowing him to feel free to explore the region. The possibility that the water itself is a simulation also exists, as simulations have previously been used to hide information from silo residents. Whatever the case, it is clear that the water poses less of a challenge, and the door that George discovered must conceal vital information that, let's hope, will be made clear in Silo Season 2. Thanks for watching, and if you're new to channel subscribe and click the bell, so you don't miss out latest videos of Media Breakdown.